So this is what happened. I was going to make this tea. It's a rose fruity milk tea. And it tastes really good. But then I got really worried because I, I noticed how like clear it was. Oh no. I noticed how clear it was. And I wasn't liking the fact that it was so like. So I added this other tea bag to it. It's like an awake bag. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let that sit. And hopefully it gets a little bit more darker. So it's not like I'm just tasting like hot flavored milk water that doesn't taste like milky tea. Guess what time it is? Tea time with the Sunbubby. Um, I thought I would kind of take a mini break. I'm, I'll give updates at the end of the video, but I wanted to do a tea time talk, uh, kind of discussing, like, where I am in the hobby right now. Um, and, I don't know, I'm just kind of blabbing and whatnot. So it's going to be one of those kind of random videos, like, blabby, blabby McBlabs. So I recently came back from, um... A convention in Corpus Christi. I went to RealmsCon. This is my badge here. And it was really cool. I had two panels, which was really nice. I had a BJD Basics panel, and then I had a um, BJD Addicts panel. And it was pretty cool. Um, the BJD Basics panel, I gave away prizes and whatnot, and that was really fun. And there was actually a pretty good turnout for that one, and just kind of went over the basics for BJDs and whatnot. And, and, and which I almost kind of feel like if I get other cons, I think I want to have like a basics because I've noticed like there's cosplay panels and then there's like beginner cosplay panel, like one on one stuff, and there's like intermediate cosplay panels. And I think what I would like to do is I'd like to have like an intermediate BJD panel and kind of like it's just so random and weird like I had a dream about this last night it was so strange I had a dream that I was at a convention and I did an intermediate panel and I actually did like a whole bunch of I guess advanced things not really advanced but like you know I actually had a demonstration of restringing a doll I think I made some stuff or something I don't know what I made I, I don't remember in my dream what I made but it, it, I woke up and it got me thinking like if I go to more panels and um, if I get more panels and I go to more conventions, I think I want to start doing like, you know, a basics panel like for people that don't know anything about the hobby and then an intermediate panel um, and then maybe continue on doing the, the BJD Addicts um, panel that I, that I started running. And it was really cool. The BGD Addicts panel, like, there were people inside uh, the panel there that owned dolls. So I kind of kind of did, like, a round robin. Like, I asked some of the prompt questions, and I had people, like, that wanted to share. They kind of shared their own experiences, and then we kind of went around the room. And I thought it was really nice. And it was, that one was a pretty good turnout, too, considering that it was, like, at... 10 o'clock or 10 30 it was a late panel and I was just like wow what am I gonna do like what if nobody comes and um but it was still really really nice uh to see all the people there and it was really nice to meet um everyone that came by and whatnot in other news I actually moved all my dolls over here now I had I had like my SDs in my husband's office and then like I felt really like distant like I'd work I work in this room a lot and now I shoot my videos in here you know, because I have more privacy and whatnot, because I don't have to worry about, you know, disturbing my husband or my husband's disturbing me. Um, and I, um, so I, I moved them all over here, and it's so crazy looking at them now, like, just looking at all of them that are here. I have, I have a lot of dolls. I have a lot, which is so amazing, because I would have never, ever, ever ever imagined I would have had this many dolls. It's just insane. But I'm totally loving it. Love, 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 love it. Um, and I even have some dolls over here. I know you can't see them, but I've got like my OSD sitting on this big box over here, and then I have Sophie and Ash sitting over here. So it's really cool, and I really love the new ones that, I, that I've that i acquired. Um, 
I, I haven't named him yet. This is um one of the newer ones. This is the Mystics Kids that I got in the Ellis and um I don't I don't know what to name him yet. At first I thought, you know, I'd do a playoff of um, you know, his company name and for some odd reason I really liked Eli and I I don't know if I want to name him Eli or not. But I really like him. I haven't decided where he would fall in with the rest of my guys, though. <laughs> I don't know who he is. I think he might be just like a school... He looks like he'd be a friend of Ash's, because Ash looks very calm and collected, you know, and very, you know, I guess, normal guy type person. I don't think he really fits in with Therese's group, you know. he Therese's got like a wild group. He's <laughs> got, like, got like a wild bunch of friends. And I don't, I don't really think, I don't feel that vibe from him, so I don't think he's a part of that. I think he's just friends with, with, with Ash. I feel bad though, I need to get him shoes. I'm actually, um, I'm gonna go shopping for all of my dolls. Um, once I get my money's in, because, um, unfortunately, you know, being a teacher, you don't get paid, you know, every two weeks. You only get paid. Well, our school, you know, in district, only gives us a paycheck once every month at the end of the month. So it is not exactly the coolest thing ever. We have to wait forever. And then I have some money that I got from commissions. Yay! And then um, I have I have some other stuff that I'm pulling together. So I'm going to buy them all some stuff, hopefully. Not everybody, because I don't have that don't have that much money, but I'm probably going to buy, like, crucial things like, you know, shoes. This guy needs shoes and, um, a couple of other just random things that I need to buy for them. <clears throat> Some more clothing, because they're pretty much wearing all the clothes that I have. So I'm probably going to do that and get them some stuff. A lot of my MSDs up there already have shoes. Which you guys don't know about yet. Unless you saw my Tumblr and you took a good guess. But she's up there. Um, I have to do a review for her. I have to do a review for her and my other friends. But that's in an update at the end of the video to share with you guys about. But, um, yeah. I really I really like them. They're such a, like, a really good group. And I really like... Um, I, don't, I don't know if I shared with you all. Like, I recently bought some wigs from um, another fellow YouTube person from Sarah, and I really, really, really like the wigs that, you know, I bought from her. They're really, really nice and, and well, can like, well shaped and good condition and whatnot. So I like this yellow one that I put on Noel, and I really like it. I think it looks really cool. I think it gives him more of a kind of punky look, which he's supposed to have a more punkyish outlook to him, because he's one of Therese's friends. Um, so I'm just... I'm just loving him. And I just love him. I love my, my Apollo. He's so cool and whatnot. And, you know, I love him so much. Um, but I do need to do my experiment, which I will hopefully record for you guys and show you how it works out. But I wanted to wire him um, just so he could have more stability and whatnot and so his arms and stuff aren't so wishy-washy and floppy. <sighs> And then eventually, I'd like to do the modification to his hips. I don't know how that's going to work out. <laughs> Hopefully, okay. Thinking, I'm thinking that I'm going to do it to Kai's old body first, and then if it works out well, I'll do it to his body. Because I'm too scared of messing it up. <laughs> so, it'll be an adventure, and I'll record that hopefully soon. I just haven't gotten around to doing any of that crazy stuff. So, But I love him! I love him so much. He's so cool. I love, I love Noel. He's... He's something else. I love Noel. <clears throat> yeah, so, um, kind of wanted to do another, like, just random quick plug. Um, my website, I know I haven't updated the blog. I've been updating it maybe, like, once a month. Um, I really, really, really want to kind of put secret videos in there. And I had put a secret video in there that I had it unlisted on YouTube. And the only way that you saw it is if you went to the website. Um, so I kind of just wanted to sh like shamelessly plug that in there. If you guys ever um, have free time and you want to check out my website, I'm going to hopefully, 
because I know I've gotten questions about like you know hey Asimva like where do you post the backstories on your dolls and like you know where do you talk about you know what kind of you know characteristics or personalities they have or whatever that is where I'm going to post them I'm definitely I mean I'm paying for that website so I gotta put it to good use uh, I already have some of the stuff set up like I think I have three maybe four profiles but they're like bio pages. They're not like the stories yet. And I just haven't honestly written out the story. It's all in here. So I haven't really actually like sat down and like started reading chapter one, you know, you know, or writing chapter one or anything like that, you know. So, um, but that is going to be the place to go look if you're interested in, you know, my doll's backstories and whatnot. And then I also have, you know, extra things about the reviews that I've done for some of the dolls and, um, like I said, I'm going to try to put some, like, you know, sneak peek or behind-the-scenes stuff in, in my website and whatnot. So, um, I also, uh, in my blogs, I do random stuff. <laughs> some of them, I kind of, I try to make it funny because, you know, I, I personally have a hard time reading things. Like, it has to be kind of humorous to me or, you know have visuals or something so in my blogs I try to at least include some pictures and you know some humor to it so if you're having like a rough day maybe you can check a blog out and hopefully it makes you laugh so, so yeah that's www.resinreality.com so yeah I don't want to bore you all with more blabber because I told you this was going to be like a random blabity blab blab big blab video um but I do want to leave you with this because I've gotten two um, new things in to do reviews for, and I know you guys have asked me, I just spent all day yesterday getting back to everyone's messages. I swear there was like a hundred plus messages. I was sitting there at my laptop at Starbucks like for a long time. I know some of you guys were asking me in some of my, um, videos, hey, you're gonna do like the review for the, for the Hujo Nano Freya's, you know, or the Hujo Nano's, um, the Freya Nano's. Baby kittens, the kittens. Uh, yes, I do have them here, and I will be doing the review. Um, and I gotta tell you, man, these are like so freaking cute. Like, I think they're just really amazing. And I don't know if you guys noticed on my Tumblr or not, but I have a brand new girl, which is convenient and super awesome because I had quite a few of you asking if I could do a review on a Mystics Kids girl. So, I do have one here now, so I will be doing a review on her. It's a Mystic Kids Lillian, and I gotta tell you guys, I'm already flabbergasted. Like, I was blown away when, as soon as I opened her up. I was just like, holy crap, this is awesome. I've, uh, you will see me blab on about how awesome she is, and you guys will love it, and you guys are gonna have to go out and buy Mystic Kids now, because they're amazing. Um, and they came with panties and bras. I was like, it's like a bandeau. It's like, I was like so pleased when I opened it up. I was like, oh my god, she's got panties too. That's awesome. So yeah, um, I'll be doing a review on her, um, as well so you guys can take a look at that. So I've got two reviews coming up. So I, uh, <laughs> I actually hit my 4,000 subscriber mark. I'm like so, I don't even know what to say. Like really, like, <sighs> I, I, I'm just amazed that it's just gotten this big. Um, deeply, deeply honored. I really honestly don't, like, I don't, I don't know what to say. Like, it's just really awesome and I'm so grateful and thankful um, that there's so many positive people out there that leave me just really nice comments. Um, just really amazing people out there. It's always, always such a pleasure to hear from anybody whenever they message me and they tell me like, you know, that they got a new doll in or, you know, um, they're excited because they ordered something, you know, it's just really exciting. I'm, I, I'm just as excited as you guys whenever you send me those messages. Like I'm writing back in all caps. I'm like, ah, that's awesome. You know, it's just really, really cool. Um, so to, to finally hit, you know, 4,000 subscribers is really crazy amazing, so thank you guys out there. I really do appreciate it. I appreciate everyone that comments, that likes my videos, that subscribes, you know, that, you know, reblog some of my stuff on Tumblr. I'm just super duper thankful and very grateful. I'm very, very honored 
to have this many people, you know, watching my videos of me and my dolls being cuckoo, cuckoo, you know? So, uh, thank you guys, really, honestly, thank you so much. So, as luck would have it, um, the ending of my video got, I don't know what happened to it. I think I was talking too much and then, like, it didn't record all of it. So, I'm gonna end with, uh, showing you guys my dolls here and kind of talking about what I was talking about. They got, you know, deleted. So, if you guys have suggestions for a video that you'd like to see, um, <laughs> I guess I'm glad that that video got deleted because I had, oh god, she's like laying there. <laughs> I, uh, I blabbed forever talking about how guilty I felt about previous things that I've done and videos I have not been able to do. Um, but yeah, if you guys have a suggestion, please leave it in the comments section below if there's a particular video that you would like to see, uh, me do. Um, whether it's like a, you know, music video or crazy, like, you know, what, um, what I've, uh, you know, what am I watching thing. I feel so bad because she's laying down. Uh, what, what am I watching? If you remember that weird little series of video that I did, um, I'm more than happy to do that. So just let me know and I will go ahead and try my best to get that video out because, you know, I really do want to thank you all for your support and, um, you guys being so awesome and whatnot. So, yeah, well, um, Hope you guys have an awesome day. I superly duperly uh, heart every single one of you all out there. And I will see you guys in another video superly duperly soon. Kai and you, I say bye. And the rest of my gang says goodbye. Everyone says goodbye. Bye. Bye. Bye 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 bye. Tea time with Jason.